Hello, thank you for tuning in. Um, I just want to share uh, some scriptures that are coming to pass in ways that most people, or at least the wicked, um, can't possibly conceive because they are under the judgment of God. Um, I have made a video like yesterday, two days ago, that has not uploaded yet. Hopefully it will get up, but I really hope the Islamic community uh, sees that video. So I'm in Second Nephi 27. Uh, the chapter most famously known in the Book of Mormon for the Kurt Cobain prophecies. So we're seeing uh, 27 verse 3 come to pass. And all nations that fight against Mount Zion and that distress her shall be as a dream of a night vision. Ye, it shall be unto them even as a hungry man which dreams. And behold, he eats, but he awakes, and his soul is empty. Or like unto a thirsty man which dreams, and behold, he drinks, but he awakes. And behold, he is faint, and his soul... <clears throat> Has appetite, and even so shall the multitude of the nations that be the fight against Mount Zion. So we could also compare Isaiah chapter twenty nine um, to Second Nephi uh, twenty seven. So what do what does this mean? I'm going to explain at least what I'm experiencing on my end, and um, basically the Ezekiel wheels are turning, um, quantum shifts are turning from the heavenly father and um you know we reap what we sow all all what the enemy does behind their back without us knowing well god keeps changing realities but at least for me or at least for the righteous um because i do believe the saints of god are on the same page as me um at least for me um all my enemies um Everyone is just going back and back in time and it just goes faster and faster and faster every couple hours, maybe every hour. It's like all of a sudden, you know, I'm, I'm this other person and this never happened. And, you know, they're all the way back when I first found out about 9-11. I mean, for me, that was like six months ago, but it's happening today. And to me, you know, they're just way behind. They'll never catch up. All my all the YouTube videos I'm watching, you know. All the apostates out there, I, I wish you could know. I, I, I post videos and post videos, but y you guys can't know because every time it's like you're brand new to this attack. And um, uh, all I do is watch your videos and see how you say, oh, this guy is just changing and all, you know, and, you know, <laughs> I don't know. It just keeps happening over and over and over again. And the more they attack... Um, the fiercer and quicker God's judgment is. So all they could do is melt in a frying pan, as the book of Ezekiel says. So the apostates out there, you know, this uploading on my phone that, that they're consuming all my time, then they're just losing all that time in quantum reality, and they're that much time behind. And it's just going to get consumed away. The righteous, their victims are ahead of them in time, and they're going to get consumed and not going to know what's happening behind their back. As they reap what they sow. Um, it's very fierce. It's like a lawnmower. And it just gets stronger and stronger um, every day. So, you know, when I watch your videos out there, all I do is see everybody just doing the same thing in a tape loop. Never mind. You wouldn't understand anyway. Never mind. You wouldn't understand anyway. They're just talking about, oh, how he changed and how he's talking. You just, I just keep seeing you guys saying the same thing. Talking about things that do not matter. Um, way ahead of you. So this is, if you can conceive of what I'm saying, this is how we could perceive 2 Nephi 23, uh, 27 verse 3. <coughs> Quite amazing. Uh, God be, Allah be with you all. And um, may the truth march on and shine forth. I pray these videos get up. Thank you.